I like Miles Morales. I love the concept that anyone from any racial background could be Spider-Man. I love his companions and his titles, and I love Miles' motivation for taking on the mantle of Spider-Man. But I, and a few others, have a problem with him. And it's not because he's black, it's because I think he's kind of boring. My name is Joshua C, and today I'm going to explain why I think Miles is an uninteresting character. The reason why I think he's quite uninteresting is because he doesn't have a strong personality or any unique traits that make him stand out compared to the other heroes. I mean, Batman is dark and brooding, the Punisher is merciless and violent, the Flash is optimistic and analytical, and even each of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles have their own unique and special personality that make every one of them loved. Many people say that a compelling superhero must be interesting even before they get their powers, but Miles doesn't really fit that bill. If Miles Morales were to have all the superhero stuff removed from his life, and if he were to have a solo book, his life and his personality isn't very interesting, and it isn't interesting enough to grab readers. Okay, so now let's dive into Miles' personality. Okay, so after rereading and studying Miles Morales comics, I still believe in what I'm saying. Miles doesn't really have any distinct personality traits. He also doesn't express much of himself by joining certain school activities or doing any hobbies besides guitar, which we never have seen. And when you look into Miles Morales' character, he's just a normal, introverted teenage boy without any special or unique personality. And I know that Peter Parker was also a normal, introverted teenage boy when he first debuted, but during that time period, it was revolutionary and proved that even a young lad could become a superhero. He also had a special love for science and was one of the only superheroes who made quips at the time. And Miles just basically copied that. He's also smart, not that smart though, to make web shooters, and he also makes a lot of quips when he fights bad guys. So for me, Miles is generally just Peter Parker, who's more depressing with less unique traits. Okay, so I believe I proved my point, but fun fact, Miles' personality problem previously served a purpose. Miles actually allowed Peter to grow and mature by being identical to him. I mean, he's not exactly a carbon copy of Peter, but they have actually a lot of commonalities. Both of them are smart, have one or more parents that used to be S.H.I.E.L.D. agents, fight some of the same villains, and are barely staying afloat financially speaking. So what I'm basically saying is that if you don't like the more happy and mature Peter Parker that Dan Slott created, you can read the Miles title because he's almost like Peter when he was young. Peter has been back to normal for a while, so Miles doesn't really serve any purpose. And I think Marvel knows this because after a while, Miles' title finally got cancelled. By the way, I'm not saying the Miles title is boring. I enjoyed it quite a bit. It had some interesting stuff, but um, the unique stuff about the Miles title are not enough to grab your attention and keep purchasing this book. It's pretty sad, but if this error of Miles is going to be fixed, I highly believe it's ultimately taking place in this year's Spider-Man Into the Spider-Verse. Based on the two trailers we have received so far, we could somewhat see that Miles is already a spider bite different. In the second trailer, Peter says a line that 
tingled my spider sense. Okay, I'm gonna stop with the spare phones. But it potentially proves that Miles is going to have a more distinct personality in the movie. Anyway, here it is. One thing I know for sure, don't do it like me. Do it like you. Brooklyn! It just elevates my hope to a whole new level. Anyway, what is your opinion? And where do you stand on this subject? Do you agree with me on the fact that Miles is a bland character? And if not, tell me why I'm wrong. I would really love to know. Leave all those words and maybe more in the comments. My name is Josh C and I will see you in the next comic book video.